The morning of June 4 was important. It was the final preparation for something a long time coming, the fulfillment of hard work and a dream. Today is the um, dedication of Café Huso y Mas. We're celebrating uh, this new, uh, new dream uh, that has uh, become reality. Uh, three organizations, uh, Café Justo, Frontera Cristo, and CREDA, a drug rehab center we partner with. It's a great day! It's just a wonderful celebration of how God brings us together for a common purpose uh, and to celebrate the goodness of life and, and new possibilities uh, for our communities uh, and for our world. The day included a traditional ribbon cutting. The ballet folklorico dancers helped us celebrate. We asked God to bless what we were doing. And our coffee growers each spoke and shared their own piece of the Café Justo story. And so with this small group, we began Café Justo y Mas, and we began selling small bags of coffee. Y la dedicación de nuestro nuevo negocio and Café the dedication Justo y Mas, of the new business of Just Coffee and More. Fue de mucha emoción. It was a very emotional, where our clients, aún personas que no sabían de Café Justo, even those people who did not know anything about Just Coffee understand the vision of uh, Just Coffee. A vision not only of the coffee grower's economic self-determination, but a larger dream for the Café Justo y Mas to serve as a safe haven. We want to share with the people uh, a special place where they can meet each other but a heaven a place without drugs and alcohol. One of our dreams for Café Justo Amas is to have a place for our partners at the rehab center CREDA to re-enter society and find their own gifts and talents and their place in God's kingdom. And that is now a reality. I am a member of CREDA. I'm now working at Café Justo. I am uh, very grateful for it putting me back into society. They trust me and come in uh, here, get a job, work, do my stuff, and people start believing on me again as a person, not, um, not like on what I used to be. And the, the peace pole will come here to the front. That day we also planted a peace pole to serve as a reminder that this building is dedicated as a place of peace. For individuals, for our families, for our communities, and for our nations. I am a mother. Isabel que ellos podrán estar en un lugar seguro. And to know that uh, my children can be in a safe place. Y también saber que ellos están aprendiendo a vivir en paz con los demás. And also to know they are also learning about how to live in peace with, with others. After the ceremony and dedication, we open the cafe. The thing that I like uh, about a dedication was people from the States and Mexican people uh, are coming together to celebrate opening. It was wonderful to see all the people supporting us and what we have all built together. It does. It feels, it feels wonderful. Um, God has brought together us uh, to work together uh, to, to build not just not a building, uh, but a community. Uh, a community of people who come together uh, and celebrate uh, God's love and God's grace, God's forgiveness, uh, and, and the ways in which we can work together for a more, uh, more just world. It makes me very happy to be able to share with so many uh, cultures. Todos estamos trabajando por la paz. We all are working together for peace. Y saber que en una taza de café, 
and to know in a cup of coffee. También podemos hacer justicia. We can also do justice.